The JK05A allows you to diagnose and determine treatment for eustachian tube dysfunctions, including blockage of the eustachian tube, patulous eustachian tube, and serous otitis media. For the sonotubometry test, a speaker probe is inserted into one nostril, producing a 7 kHz octave band noise. This is measured by a microphone inserted into the ear canal. Caution, do not insert the sonotubometry speaker into the ear canal. This section will demonstrate the full test procedure. Turn on the power switch. Push the sono button to set the test mode to sonotubometry. You can set the required conditions, including test protocols, by pressing the menu button. When the patient swallows, the eustachian tube opens and closes, allowing sound from the speaker probe to pass through the eustachian tube via the nasal cavity. This sound is detected as a pressure level by the sonotubometry probe's microphone and is displayed on the screen in channel 1. Pharyngeal noise produced when swallowing is displayed on the screen in channel 2. Before conducting the test, select an appropriately sized earplug to ensure that the patient's ear canal is sealed and that there is no air leakage. Clean the probe and speaker thoroughly with a damp cloth moistened with disinfectant solution. Provide the following instructions to your patient during the test. Ask the patient to hold the sonotubometry speaker with both hands and insert it into one of their nostrils. When the test starts, they will hear a whooshing noise. Make sure they know not to move the speaker. On your cue, ask the patient to swallow. You may advise patients with difficulty swallowing to hold a sip of water in their mouth and drink small portions at a time. This section will demonstrate the full test procedure Begin by inserting the earplug into the patient's ear canal. Instruct the patient to hold the speaker with both hands and insert its tip into one of their nostrils. Push the start-stop button to begin the measurement. The machine will calibrate automatically and the test will begin. Calibration can also be performed manually. The test screen will begin to scroll to the left. Instruct the patient to swallow. Press the start stop button to finish the test once the data you need has been recorded. The machine will record up to 30 seconds of data at one time. Test results displayed on the screen can be scrolled by turning the main dial. Push the print button to print the test results. Finally, press the clear button to delete the recorded data.